have sworn that I was walking into a Starbucks. Hi, welcome to heaven. Is that like a new coffee shop? No, you died and you're in heaven now. Okay, where are the cameras? I'm being pranked, right? It's not a prank. You dropped your phone going into Starbucks and then an elderly woman ran you over. That's a tragic way to die. Maybe you should get off your phone. This isn't heaven just yet. You have to have enough good points to go. Otherwise, you go to the bad place. I don't want to go there. Then you have to go back to Earth to make amends with those you've hurt. Okay, fine. I'll go back to Earth to right my wrongs. The first person you must see is Lacey. Oh my god, no, I hate her. You have to apologize. Fine. Hey, Lacey. Ah! But you just died. I've come back to make amends with you. I'm sorry, it was wrong of me to give you food poisoning so that I could have the lead in the school play. You did that? That's not why I hate you. What? You let my pet bird fly away. Oh yeah, I'm sorry for that too. No, you're not. You know what? I don't forgive you. What? You failed and have two more chances. Would you like to take them? Okay, yes, I'll take them. You have two more chances. Would you like to take them? Okay, yes, I'll take them. The next person is your older sister. Why would I need to apologize to my sister? She loved me. Are you sure about that? Hey, sis. Oh my god, am I hallucinating? No, I've come to make amends. No way, you can't fix what's been done. I don't even know what I did. I thought that you loved me. How could I love you? Our parents gave you everything and they gave me nothing. They clearly liked you more. But that wasn't my fault. But you never stuck up for me or tried to include me. Listen, I'm sorry that they didn't treat you the same as they treat me, but I love you and I would never mean to hurt you like that. I'm sorry too. I've been holding a grudge for so long, but I can let it go. I should have told you how I felt sooner. It's okay. I forgive you. I don't want any bad blood between us. Congratulations, you succeeded. One more and you'll make it to heaven. I can do it. Who is it? Your mother. No, I'm not doing that. You have to unless you want to go to the bad place. Why am I a girl? No, I'm definitely a girl right now. Honey, get down here. You're going to be late for school. Uh, I can't. I have my period. Don't be silly. Just put a tampon in. Come on. Why does it look like a weapon? We have to go now. Get dressed. Hey, bro, what's up? Did you see the game last night? Um, what? I mean, nothing. <laughs> Bye. You have got to be joking. What are you wearing? What? What do you mean? I've never seen you wear anything but pink. Does your hat say milk? Yeah, you know it. Give me one. No, I'm not gonna give you one. Whatever, let's go. We have to watch over the new cheerleaders. The cheerleaders? Because we're the captains. Don't tell me you don't remember. Of course I remember. Hey, why don't you come demonstrate the cheers with me? No, I'm good. I'm feeling sick, but I love watching. Okay, if you say so. What's the matter, towel boy? Aren't you gonna pick that one up? What a loser. Oh, shit. Headphones or sunglasses? What? I want headphones so I can listen to Olivia Rodrigo on full volume. They won't play any music? What the heck is the point of these stupid things? I hate being your friend and I wish that I never met you. What did you just say to me? Um, all I said was good morning, how are you? I swore you said something else. No, definitely not. I slept with your best friend. You're cheating on me? Baby, what? No, why would you say that? I knew you were a lying little piece of sh- It was only one time. No, we're done. Don't talk to me. Mary, I need you to say something to me. Um, like what? Anything. I really like the shirt you're wearing. Okay, now say it one more time. That shirt is hideous. This is my favorite shirt. What? But I said that I liked it. These headphones let me hear the truth. <gasps> Can you tell me if my boyfriend's cheating on me then? Girl, you literally saw him making out with someone else. But I love him. I smell your shoes while you're in gym. Ew, what is wrong with you? The scent of your feet is great. Reason? Reason of what? Sorry, I forgot to tell you. You have to pick the reason you die. I don't want to choose the reason that I die. You have to. We all do. Well, it's definitely not going to be by drowning. I'm going to pick the most painless one that I can. Good luck. I don't think any of the options are good. Murder? Oh my god, that's way worse. No. Can this give me an option that doesn't suck brutally? <laughs> Bailey! No, sis, what's wrong? I didn't pick a reason in time, and it picked one for me. What? It picked one for you? Apparently, you only get three choices. I didn't know that. I'm so scared to ever get into a car again. I'm so sorry. Be careful with your choices, okay? I will. Please just give me something painless. Hey, are you okay? No, no, I can't pick that. Maybe I should have accepted the first one that it gave me. What's the reason that it gave you? I can't even say it. If it's that bad, just trust your gut and decline it. <laughs> what if it gives me this one? If you decline it, it has to refresh your reason. Okay, I'll decline it. Please don't be bad. What? What is it? It says none. 
What do you mean that it says none? It just says N-A. What, like you're just never gonna die? It just must be some kind of mistake. Maybe it doesn't load right? I don't think there are any mistakes. I don't want to live forever. All of you are gonna be gone. I don't think you have another choice. Who is banging on the door right now? Hello? You're under arrest! Under arrest? Under arrest for what? You have the wrong person. Does your reason say none? Um, yeah. Then we have the right person. Come on. Stay right here so we can start questioning. Okay. So, what did you do to be immortal forever? I didn't do anything. I just declined the options I got. Lying is only going to make this harder for both of us. I'm not lying. What did you do to hack into the system? I did not hack the system. I could barely log on to my computer correctly. Ugh, you're a stubborn one, aren't you? I'm not stubborn. I'm just trying to tell you the truth. Are you going to tell us what we need to know or not? I've been telling you the truth this whole time. This is ridiculous. Wait, guys, she is telling the truth. You took the wrong girl. Oh, then we have to wipe her memory. What? Today I'm going to try to do a full face of makeup using this filter. I do not have a mirror in front of me, so we're just going to be going off of this. I don't know if this foundation is going to be able to cover up my sick beard. It's even worse if I turn my head up. Aye, aye, aye. I got three hours of sleep last night, so I need this. Honestly, the cheekbones are already snatched. Just now notice that the nose is lopsided. Okay. Something in my tooth. Has that been there the whole time? I'm putting on a lot because I want to be blushing to the gods. Can't forget the nose. Oh, I fear that may have been too much. <laughs> Why did I just notice that there are no eyebrows? Yes, we will not be doing my eyebrows at all. The beard is transferring onto my hand. They're coming for me. It won't even line up. Oh no. Got filler in. I don't know what that looks like. Round number two. Oh, why is it glitching? You think this lip color will go with my beard? Why are they lopsided? Oh, this is the best way to do it. What happened here? Okay, guys, I think that it's time for the reveal. In three, two, one. I'm processing. Both of these wings are just tragic. The eyebrows are also throwing me off. I definitely made my lips uneven. I'm gonna have to go fix this, but let me know which filter I should try next. I don't know why I do this to myself, but let's do makeup with this filter on. You didn't believe that I'm not using an extra mirror? I am so committed to the bit. Well, I need more foundation because my head is so big right now. Bombastic side. Why is my body completely normal? Do you guys think the contour is gonna help? No such thing as too much blush. I'm gonna need a lot for this nose. Gotta set it because I'm greasier than a McDonald's chicken nugget. I want to have contour like Kim K. I can't even tell what I'm doing. Need to fix the front. To make sure they stay up all day. I don't know if that's good or not. I want so much blush that looks like Barbie threw up on me. And now I will be a disco ball. Oh my god, my nose. Uh, I will never forget my freckles. Oh no. Why does my finger look like that? I have to do eyeliner. This is not gonna go well for me. I feel like that looks kind of good. So I just way harder. Oh. This one's definitely not as good. This lipstick smells like a crayon. It's giving fish from fishtails. I think that was everything. Okay, reveal in three, two, one. Okay, hang on, it's not that bad. Gets a lot worse if we zoom in though. Look at that eyebrow. How did I even do that? But like from a distance, it's kind of good. Let me know which filter I should do next. <sighs> I need to brush my teeth, my breath stinks. <laughs> Why do I look like Christina Aguilera? 2007, that was like, a lot of years ago. Is this real? Sis, let's go. You're gonna be late for school. School? I can't go to school like this. You look fine. Stop being dramatic. Let's go. Are you guys texting on blackberries? Duh, blackberries are so cool right now. I heard that they're coming out with this thing called the iPhone and there's no buttons on it. Like the first iPhone? It's supposed to be a huge deal. Did you guys see that Rihanna just released a new song? Really? Which one? It's called Umbrella. I really like it. Have you heard it? Yeah, it's great. Oh, I hope that my crush likes my new post. Oh, where did you post it? TikTok? Um, what's that? I posted it on MySpace. Please don't put me in 2007 again. Oh, great. We went even further back in time? Wow, that is a lot of glitter. And why are my lips so pale? Bailey, your makeup looks so good today. I love the eyeshadow. Uh, yeah, thanks. I think my mom's gonna get us the new gaming system coming out. What gaming system? It's called the Xbox 360. I'm excited. That sounds super cool. Can't wait. It's so futuristic. Wait, do you guys know who Taylor Swift is? No, does she go to school here or something? Ugh, I love Kanye West so much. You like Kanye West? Yeah, his new song Gold Digger just came out. I am obsessed with it. Mm. Could you feed my Tamagotchi while I go to the bathroom? I don't want it to die. I would love to. Want to come over after school? We're going to drink beer and watch VHS tapes. 
You know what? I'm good. Okay, I just want 2011. What? 2002, I was an infant. What happened to my eyebrow? What are you talking about? They look great. I have like six hairs left. Yeah, thin eyebrows are all the rage right now. I love them. Do you at least have something to fix my lips? Why would you need to fix them? You're already wearing lip gloss. Now let's go. Please tell me you're not using a Nokia. This is the best phone on the market right now. What else would I use? I have the biggest crush on Justin Timberlake. Who's your crush? Uh, Harry Styles. Who the hell is Harry Styles? He was a skater boy, she said, see? You know that song? Yeah, it came out like a month ago. I'm so obsessed with it. I keep hearing it on the radio. Yeah, me too. You, everyone run. It's Jessica. She is so emo. What's wrong with being emo? 2011, at least I can have an iPhone now. Avril, what are you doing? We're gonna be late. Where am I? Hey, are you ready yet? We have to leave for your interview, like now. Interview about what? Don't play dumb about your new single, what the hell? Give me one second. I thought I was waking up in different years, not different bodies. Am I a part of the conspiracy theory? I have 30 seconds, let's go. Coming. Are you sure that you're ready for this interview? You seem kind of off. Yeah, I am so ready. I've never been more ready in my life. Excuse me, Avril, I am such a big fan. Could you sign this? Sure. There you go. Um, I think that you spelled your name wrong. No, I didn't. Everyone, please welcome Miss Avril Levine. How do you feel about the release of your new single? Good. Uh, how was your experience making this song in the studio? Ah, great. How do you feel about being so iconic in the pop punk space? Amazing. I'm scared to even look. 2012, why would I need to be in 2012? Taylor, are you done in there? We need to go. Who's Taylor? Don't tell me I'm in someone's body again. Miss Swift, you've been in there 40 minutes. Miss Swift, no. There you are, the car is waiting for you outside. Where are we going? To your live performance, don't tell me you forgot. Great. You know, I'm not feeling too well. I don't think a live performance is a good idea. Are you kidding me? This is gonna be huge, you have to do it. Stop goofing around, now follow me and we can go. Mm, coming. Can't we just like switch to an interview? <laughs> what is wrong with you today? Are you feeling all right? Nothing, I'm fine. You have five minutes in the dressing room and then we'll be back for you. Mm -hmm. How do I get out of here right now? I think I can fit out this window. Are you trying to climb out of a window right now? No. Really, cause you had your head out there. Ugh, my hair is itching my neck. Whoa! What the hell am I wearing? 2004, I wanna go into the future. Sis, let's go, we're gonna be late. The car's already running. Coming. Should we play some music on the way? Oh yeah, do you have an aux cord? Um, no, what's an aux cord? I was just gonna play one of mom's CDs on the stereo. A CD sounds great. Wait, if I went back in time, that means I know the future. Sorry, did you say something? Nothing. Guys, I have something super important to tell all of you. What? What's going on? In 2007, they're gonna come out with this thing called the iPhone, and it's a phone with no buttons. You just touch the screen. That is so cool. How do you know about the future? I have powers. Are there any flying cars in the future? No, but they're self-driving cars. Come on, don't stop now. Tell us something else. Also, I'm gonna be a rock star with a single called Romance is Dead. No way. Can I get an autograph? Please put me in the future. Ugh. Why do I look like a little lad? Hey, wait, are you that girl who can look into the future? Yes, I am. Can you please tell me if me and my boyfriend will still be together? I really like him. For $20. Okay, deal. You're gonna figure out that you only like women. What, how did you know that I like women? See? Uh, you're right, thank you so much. I'm gonna go break up with him. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me something about the future? What am I, a fortune teller now? Please, just tell me anything and I will give you $60. Oh yeah, there's gonna be this massive viral disease called COVID and it's gonna kill like a lot of people in 2020. Are you serious? You can't be telling the truth. I'm telling the truth, but don't be scared. It ends up being okay in like three years. That sounds horrifying. Mm. Also in 2023, you can pre-save my new single Romance is Dead with a link in my bio. I swear, if I'm in the 2000s again, Finally, I'm in the future. 2035 must be so cool. Hey sis, whoa, your phone is the size of an iPad. Duh, I have the new iPhone 46 Pro Max Mega. The what? Are you dumb? It's the best phone on the market and they just updated the hologram feature. Hologram? 
Are you done being clueless? We need to get to school. I'll be out to the car in a sec. Um, we're not taking the car. We're going on our jetpacks. Ugh. Is there a different way we can go to school? I'm a little afraid of heights. Don't be silly. We rode them to school yesterday. Wait, why are we going to the back of the school? We do this every day so people won't swarm you. Bailey, can I please have an autograph? An autograph? For what? Because I love your music so much. I'm a huge fan. I met you last year at your performance. Don't you remember? Of course I remember. Bailey, hey, look over here. Can you please sign my foot? I want to go even further into the future. No! Are you kidding me? I don't want to go back to 2020. Dude, we just got two weeks off of school. I think everyone's going to go hang at Kyle's. Want to go? I don't think we should. I know the government said stay inside, but we don't have to listen. We should listen to them and stay inside. Ugh, you are being so boring. We can just make TikToks instead. Why didn't I think of that? That is such a good idea. We should dress up as Visco girls. They're so trending right now. What do you think? Sure. Okay, in three, two, one. And I ooped. And I ooped. I think that was good. I'm so glad they brought scrunchies back. I'm going to wear them forever. They're so cute. They're not. We should do the renegade and then we can blow up. You know, I don't think I know it anymore. What do you mean? It just came out. Nothing. I'm so glad we got two weeks off of school. We're going to be out of school for a lot longer than two weeks. What are you talking about? Please don't put me anywhere near 2020 again. 2060. I wonder if I can teleport. Uh, are you watching Instagram Reels? Yeah, everyone watches Reels now since they banned TikTok. No. I know, right? It's just not the same anymore. Wait, how did you not know it was banned? Everyone still talks about it. No, I, I knew that. It just still, it still hurts. Oh, yeah. Wait, what generation of iPhone do you have? Oh, I have the iPhone 69 Pro Max Mega Jumbo 4000. Have you heard Taylor Swift's new song? Taylor Swift still makes music? Yeah, she's on her 50th studio album. Hey guys, what's up? Whoa, where did you come from? Oh, I just teleported over here from Starbucks. Is that car in the air outside the window? That's a flying car prototype. It's kind of whack. At this point, I'm just scared to see what year I'm in. 3,000? That's a little bit of a jump. Hey, sis. Oh, hey, yeah, what's up? What are you doing? I'm scrolling through my Instagram feed. You don't have a phone in your hand. Oh, I don't need it. I got the chip that lets you see your phone screen through your eyeballs. Would you want to go to France so we can get some dinner? What do you mean? Do we have like a private jet now? Oh no, I was just going to put the car into water mode, then we can go. Water mode? Like it turns into a boat? Yeah, it's way faster too. Mom, have you seen my hover shoes? I can't find them anywhere. What are hover shoes? Shoes that let you fly into the air, duh. Um, are you doing okay? Yeah, I'm just processing. The hover shoes would go with my new vintage top. Vintage? What year is it from? I think that this one's from 2023, so long ago. Yeah, it's super cute. Is this some kind of joke? I'm not being called ugly forever. Decline. Sis, I already accepted my name, the first one. <laughs> really? What was it? Sandra. Isn't that pretty? Like that girl from Greece? That's so cute. My first one was ugly. Oh, well, you accepted it, right? No, why would I accept it? I mean, it's true. You are ugly. <gasps> be careful. Don't run out of choices. Please, I'm sure the next one's going to be better than that. Anything is. Another one? Short stuff? I'm not even that short. I'm 5'3". The third one better be good. Hey, Mom, do you know what happens when you run out of name choices? We don't know. Some people think that you die. Oh. Uh, why are you asking? I've already declined two of them. They were terrible. You cannot decline the third one, whatever you do. Please don't be fat. Please. Idiot? My last one cannot be idiot. I can't take that. This name is your final option. You have to accept it. I don't want to be called idiot for the rest of my life. You really don't have a choice at this point. Well, what really happens when you run out of names? No one's ever run out, but you could die. That seems a little dramatic. I don't think you should be the one to find out. I'm gonna do it. Please don't kill me. I'm okay. Good. What happened with your name? Um, hello. What happened to the name? It picked one for me instead. Your reaction's making me think it's not good. It says car accident. <laughs> That's not even a name. 
There's gotta be some way I can change that, right? <laughs> Not that I know of, car accident. Become nameless. You should just become nameless. I don't know if I wanna have no name forever. Well, what is the other option? Being called car accident. There has got to be some way I can change it myself. I know where you can go. Bro, where did you come from? Don't worry about that. You need to go to this address alone. You want me to pull up to a random sketchy address alone? I promise they can change your name for you. Okay, I'll do it. Mm. At the door, the password is cheese. Cheese? Really? Okay. Um, oh. Hello, what's the password? Uh, cheese? Oh, yes, come right this way. So, what do you want? I need to change my name, like, really badly. I can do that, but you're gonna have to pay. Pay, like, how much money? No, not with money. The only way to get a new name is to steal one from someone you know. What? Okay, but if all of us stop paying taxes, they can't arrest everyone, right? No, that's not how that works. So my controls my hands. What does that even mean? Ow! Oh no, I don't like this. Sis, could you hold this for one sec? Sure. Wait, what are you doing? Oh no. Why would you throw that? It had grandma's ashes in it. I am so sorry. Yeah, tell that to grandma. I was on the floor now. Uh, excuse me. Class, who would like to present first? Bailey, great. Go ahead. Great. My project is about... Uh, what are you doing? Are you feeling okay? <laughs> I wish I knew. Seriously, what? Did you just dab? <laughs> Ew. Oh my god, that was the worst thing I've ever done. If you don't present, you'll get a zero in the project. What's happening? Uh-oh. But oh, you just punched me in the face. It wasn't me. You're still holding your hands up like you're going to fight me. You can't take a dog out of somebody's yard. He probably has an owner. <coughs> He's so fluffy, I couldn't resist. Oh, no, not this again. Could I borrow that pink top you have? Meow. The fuck? Meow. You have the humor of a preschooler. You know, hablas inglés. You were just speaking English to me. Puro ir a baño. I have never heard you speak Spanish before. Bailey, do you want to hang later? Howdy, y'all. Would y'all like to sip my moonshine? Uh, what? Let's go down to the creek and do some fishing. You know what? Never mind. Please don't hang out with us. Seriously, what's wrong with you? Ow, 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 ow. Are you, like, possessed or something? No! Okay, somebody get this bitch a muzzle. $20 to me or my mom. I don't really need it right now, so maybe she can use it. Hey, that bracelet is so cute. When did you get it? Oh, I used the $20 that I got this morning to go and buy it. What did you get? I gave my 20 to my mom, so nothing. That's cute or whatever, but I needed this bracelet. Do you see how cute it is? A new car, what? Well, if I give it to my mom, she'll probably just give me her old one, so... Dude, there is no way you gave that one to your mom, too. I'm gonna get a G-Wagon for my car. <sighs> Wait, why aren't you taking any of them for yourself? I don't know, I'm happy with what I have, so it's fine. Okay, you are insane if you give this one to your mom, too. Well, I'm probably still gonna live with her anyway, so it's our house. You have fun with that? I'm gonna go live in a mansion, okay? I just know you're gonna <laughs> regret that. Ooh, I could get a mansion on the beach. Um, did you just get another one, too? Um, no, I only got the three questions before. I think I just got $10 million. Um, what? What do you mean? It just says plus $10 million. Dude, what? You are so lucky. You have to give me some of that. You can have some. I can't keep it all, but I have to tell my mom. Why do you give everything to your mom? You should keep it for yourself instead. Maybe I want to, okay? I love her. I want some of the money, too. Yeah, you better give me some for lunch. Me, too. Um, I have to go. Honey, I'm sorry, but there's leftovers in the fridge for dinner. I didn't have enough money for a new meal tonight. You don't need to worry about it anymore. Why? What are you talking about? Check the bank account. How many zeros is that? Ten million dollars? Where did you get all of this from? Thank you so much. This is gonna change our lives. I love you. You guys need to give me all of the money right now. Whoa, hang on a second. You need to transfer all ten million dollars into my account by the end of the day or else. Save my mom or save all the money. You have to keep all the money, sweetheart. It'll change your life. No, mom, I can't do that to you. At least I would die knowing that you'll stay happy. I'm sorry, we can find money another way. No way you actually just gave me all of the money. See you later, suckers. I can't believe you just did that for me. I love you. Of course, I love you. We need to find some other way to make money. I'll get a second job, it'll be fine. I'll be happy with anything as long as it's with you. Me too. Bailey, I heard a rumor that you actually lost all the money. Yeah, it's true. 
I bet you're so jealous now that you have nothing. I have such a nice car and a house. Whatever. You are just so dumb. I would have saved all the money over my mom. You know what? Even if I did have the money, I wouldn't have given any of it to you. Why? What? You said that you would. You're just kind of a bitch. Um, excuse me? Hey, who's that girl over there? Oh, her? We call her Silent Beauty. She can't say anything. Why don't we go say hi? No, you cannot be seen with her. Whatever, guys. Hey, uh, my name's Ethan. I really like your hair. You remind me of the purple Teletubby. So, let me guess, you don't have any words. Don't worry, I can speak for you then. Oh, hell no, you did not bring her over here. She is not sitting with us. Why not? She's cool. No, she's not. She's just a weirdo. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't leave. I'll come sit with just you instead, not them. I just wish you could speak up for yourself. She's awful. You're the only person who's ever been nice to me. Whoa, what? You can speak? I thought you had zero words. No, I have infinite. What? You have infinite words? But everyone thinks you can't speak. I convinced everybody that I didn't have any words, but I do. But why won't you talk to anyone if you have words? Do you see how mean they are? I've been recording them. Recording them? What are you gonna do with it? Don't worry about it. How long have you been doing this? It started freshman year. I decided I was not gonna speak at all. And no one ever figured you out? Nope, they're kinda dumb. You can't tell anyone that I can actually speak, okay? I promise I am not going to. Do you want to help me expose them? Expose them like how? I know all their secrets because they think I can't tell anybody. Would we be like Bonnie and Clyde then? Yeah, I guess you could say that. This sounds like fun. Deal. Deal. Wait, what even is your name? It's Bailey. That's pretty. How are we going to do this? Don't worry. I already have it figured out. Is this some kind of joke? I'm not being called ugly forever. Decline. Sis, I already accepted my name, the first one. Really? What was it? Sandra, isn't that pretty? Like that girl from Greece? That's so cute. My first one was ugly. Oh, well, you accepted it, right? No, why would I accept it? I mean, it's true, you are ugly. No. Be careful, don't run out of choices. Please, I'm sure the next one's gonna be better than that. Anything is. Another one? Short stuff? I'm not even that short, I'm 5'3". The third one better be good. Hey, Mom, do you know what happens when you run out of name choices? We don't know. Some people think that you die. Oh. Uh, why are you asking? I've already declined two of them. They were terrible. You cannot decline the third one, whatever you do. Please don't be fat. Please. Idiot? My last one cannot be idiot. I can't take that. This name is your final option. You have to accept it. I don't want to be called idiot for the rest of my life. You really don't have a choice at this point. Well, what really happens when you run out of names? No one's ever run out, but you could die. That seems a little dramatic. I don't think you should be the one to find out. I'm going to do it. Please don't kill me. I'm okay. Good. What happened with your name? Um, hello. What happened to the name? It picked one for me instead. Your reaction's making me think it's not good. It says car accident. <laughs> That's not even a name. There's got to be some way I can change that, right? <laughs> not that I know of, car accident. Become nameless. You should just become nameless. I don't know if I want to have no name forever. Well, what is the other option? Being called car accident. There has got to be some way I can change it myself. I know where you can go. Bro, where did you come from? Don't worry about that. You need to go to this address alone. You want me to pull up to a random sketchy address alone? I promise they can change your name for you. Okay, I'll do it. Mm. At the door, the password is cheese. Cheese? Really? Okay. Um, oh. Hello, what's the password? Uh... Cheese? Oh, yes. Come right this way. So, what do you want? I need to change my name, like, really badly. I can do that, but you're gonna have to pay. Pay, like, how much money? No, not with money. The only way to get a new name is to steal one from someone you know. What? 7-1? Uh, 
What is my soulmate Bigfoot or something? Man's is like a walking skyscraper. My soulmate's only 5'4! Aw, short king. No, it's not cute. Why not? All of my kids are gonna be so short. <laughs> well, it's better than the ugly gene that you're gonna give them. <gasps> I am not ugly. Um, who are you looking for? <laughs> my soulmate. That's how you're gonna find him? You know, I don't think I could miss him. He is 7'1". That is so funny considering you're like 4'11", right? Okay, first of all, I'm 5'2". Thank you. Maybe he's like an NBA player. <laughs> I really hope so. Bro, are you drinking from a salsa jar? 7'1's not like that tall, right? Are you dumb? That's really tall. <laughs> What's with all the commotion? Dude, there's a guy in the hall that literally looks like Slenderman. My soulmate! Excuse me, sorry, excuse me, I need to get through. We all want to talk to him, wait your turn. He's definitely not going to talk to you when you look like Shrek. What? Shrek? <sighs> Bro, he's literally built like the Eiffel Tower. Well, how tall do you think he actually is? It's got to be over seven feet. Can y'all stop shoving me like this is the Hunger Games? It's a dude! Wah, wah, wah. These girls are going feral for him, I'm not going to be able to get to him. Um, I think I know how we can. How? Here, get onto my shoulders. <laughs> okay. Are you sure this is safe? Nope, not at all. Okay. Hey, moving skyscraper, wait up. Hey, Bailey, how's the weather up there? Shut up. Sir, hi, how tall are you? Um, 7'3". Ugh. What, do you have something against tall guys? Oh, I'm sorry. That just means that you're not my soulmate. How tall is your soulmate? 7'1". Oh, my brother 7'1". A brother? So, where's your brother at? Um, I don't know, he didn't come with me. What do you mean you don't know? It's like, urgent. Why do you care so much about where my brother is? Hard to explain. You are so weird, I'm out. Uh, wait, please! Bro, no, you're freaking me out. Can you just leave me alone? Okay, I'm sorry. So, do you want to get down, or- Yes, I want to get off your shoulders. Whatever, he looked like a grasshopper and his brother probably does too. You're just mad he didn't like you. Do you think that the brother goes here too? <laughs> Who knows, but he's 7-1. I'll see him. Yeah, but will he even see you? What do you mean? You're just like so much shorter than him. I've had enough of the short slander. This is so annoying. Oh my god, there's two of them! Two of who? We need to get his attention, now! Throw something at him! Okay. Not a glass! Oh! Bro, are you kidding me? Which one of you just threw a glass at my head? Should we run? Um, I think so. Yeah, okay. You two, stop right there! So are you the one who threw mm -hmm. the glass? Guilty. You need to come with us to the office now. Damn, we got caught. There was like 12 witnesses. Thanks to you, he now has a concussion. He has a concussion? I just wanted to get his attention. So you throw the most dangerous thing you could find. It seemed like a better idea at the time. Wait, are you the girl who's been harassing my brother? Ah, uh, no, it wasn't me. Who else would have purple hair? Shit. Could you just tell me why you did it? Because I needed to talk to you. To me? About what? How tall is your soulmate? Um, I am not telling you that. Just tell me. It says 5'2". Wait, don't tell me you think that we're soulmates. Surprise! No way, you are not going to be my soulmate. What's that supposed to mean? You are obviously some kind of crazy. I don't like it. That is not true. I told you why I threw the glass. Yeah, but that doesn't justify it. Uh, well... I am so done with this game you're playing, I'm leaving. No, wait! So, um, I don't think he's gonna press charges. He didn't seem very concussed. That's the girl who threw the glass. <gasps> really? Why are y'all whispering about me when I'm right here? Oh, <laughs> sorry, I didn't know you could hear us. Of course I can hear you! It's just embarrassing that you were so desperate for attention. Whatever, it's also embarrassing that your hair looks like that. My hair is $3,000! Mm. Um, I think that our plan may have backfired a little. Yeah, just like the smallest bit. I know he's my soulmate. I just need a new plan. What? It's not like you can go after his twin. Wait. No, do not tell me that. Hey, you. What? Are you going to throw a glass at my head, too? No. You're going to use me to get my brother. No, that's not what I'm doing at all. I promise. 
It's clear you're just desperate for a soulmate. No, I was trying to get your attention all along. I just thought you were really cute. Wait, really? Would you want to hang out with me? Yeah, yeah, love to. Here's my number. Thanks. That was, like, suspiciously easy. No, there's got to be a catch, right? There definitely is. He just said that I was harassing him, and he agrees that fast? I don't know. Maybe it's because you're cute. I know. Oh my gosh, what if he, like, murders you or something? Okay, let's not manifest that for me. Thanks. It should be one, four. Yep, this is it. Hey, uh, welcome in. <laughs> Hi. Both of you? Listen, we just have a few things to ask you. So, why are you such a whore? Excuse me? Uh, I'm just messing with you. That's not one of the questions. Okay, not funny, but go on. You need to tell me how tall your best friend is. She's 5'6". Why? Because my soulmate is 5'6", too. Don't tell me you think she's your soulmate. She might be if you're my brother's. I already said I don't want you as a soulmate. I don't want you either, Skyscraper. So, can you help me here? No. What? Why not? <sighs> I just don't want to. It's because she's a selfish bitch. Can he leave the room? Because he's really killing the vibes. Yeah, bro, get out of here. Listen, I'll help you get my best friend if you help me get your brother. Ah, okay, I guess I can help you. Fine. Deal. Just don't throw any more glasses at his head. I know, that was a one-time thing, I swear. Hmm, I have an idea. I need to go find my best friend. Can you convince your brother not to hate me? I will try my best. Okay, thanks. Bestie. Hey, what's up? I have some tea. Do you want to hear it? Um, yes, always. Do you know that kid who's 7'3"? How could I not? I heard he has a crush on you. Oh, I'm not interested. He's not really my type. What do you mean he's not your type? He's so tall. Yeah, but it's like a little too tall. Didn't you just call your soulmate a walking skyscraper? No, I love men that are two feet taller than me. Right. Just forget it, okay? I don't want him. Wait, please. I'll pay you. Wait, are you serious? <laughs> yeah. How much are we talking here? A thousand dollars. Oh, absolutely. I'll do whatever. Yay! Oh, I'm gonna be dirt poor. This is so dumb. He's not my soulmate anyway. Mine's 5'9". Wait, what? That's why I think Grimace should run for president. That was the stupidest shit I've ever heard. Everyone bullies me or everyone flirts with me. Honestly, I want to know what they have to say about me. Hey, do you have a pencil I could borrow? Yeah, you can take this one and shove it right up your ass, you dumb fucking bitch. Okay, thanks. I've literally seen toes that are prettier than you. Toes don't even have a face. Yeah, exactly. Have you ever thought about the world ending? Uh, no. If we were the last two people on Earth and had to repopulate, I would just let everyone die instead. I gotta give it to them. They're definitely clever. Hey, I heard you've been making music. Yeah, I have. It was so bad, it made me want to rip my ears off of my head and put them into a blender. Hey, Bailey. What? You should put this brown paper bag on your head so we don't have to look at your ugly face anymore. Sis, I swear, if you make the bathroom smell that bad again... Okay, sorry, I won't. Everyone can't see me or everyone can't hear me. I feel like I could use being invisible for a day. I am so glad Bailey's not here today. I genuinely hate her. Me too, she's so annoying. Fake ass bitch. Why is there a dick on your face? What? What do you mean? Class, settle down and get that off of your face. Ass hat. Hey, who said that? Mary. Huh? What? The answer is 76. Where is that voice coming from? I'm a genie, and I'm going to get you 100% on this test. Really? Thank you so much. Do people still feel if I hit them? Ow, what the fuck? Quiet, we're testing. Marissa, why did you answer in the shape of a Christmas tree? Because the magic genie told me to do it this way. <laughs> wow, okay, how about we take you to get some help? Hey, sis. Oh my god, what is that smell? That McDonald's bag has been in here since like 2012. I think that just burned all the hair off the inside of my nose. Yes! I was not done being invisible. Bro, I just matched with the finest girl on Tinder. Does your girlfriend Bailey know that? No, of course not. Dude, why would you pour that on me? It looks like I pissed my pants. <laughs> it wasn't me. Where did that laugh come from? I can't believe the teacher thought I was crazy yesterday. The genie was real. <clears throat> Ow, bitch. Why would you push me? I didn't push you. You little bitch. 
All right, everyone, today we will be having a pop quiz. Everyone, please take out a pencil and- Okay, who did that? It's not funny. No one's by the light switch. We have a ah! dog! 30 people can't oh die! Oh my gosh, no. I'm too young to die! Okay, what is it this time? Whenever a thunderstorm is really scary, you go sleep with your mommy again. What? No, I don't. I have never told anyone that. Don't repeat it. I already put it on Twitter. Oh, of course you did. How did you know that? I know the weirdest thing about everyone. Oh, it's time to expose people. Bailey looking hideous per usual. You have a crush on the red Teletubby. Yeah, and what about it? Red is hot and they're so slim thick. I'm not embarrassed by anything. You fart so badly in your sleep that the rest of your family has to wear a gas mask. Oh, is that why it smells That's so bad gross. in here? Leave my boyfriend alone. You haven't brushed your teeth in five years. I brushed them with Dr. Pepper. You must be a witch to know all of this. You buy used women's underwear off of Craigslist. I get them for a good deal. Are you a psychic or something? When you're low on money, you sell your bathtub water to old men on the internet. You'd be surprised how much money I make. What about me? What do you got? You have a crush on your sister. Ah, uh, she's my stepsister. Blood related. Sweet Ew. home what Alabama. Why are you so weird? The last thing you searched was how to tell if you're pregnant. <gasps> Don't tell anyone that. I was just paranoid, okay? Today she's Google, apparently. Right, I don't believe that. The last thing you looked up was, is this a rash or an STD? My balls were red and itchy. I had to find out. I still don't believe you. What did I search yesterday? You searched up, is it illegal to have a crush on your own mom? Ew, is your mom the one who gave you the rash? No, no. Hey, what about me? You looked up, why am I attracted to my own dog? No, I didn't. That was a typo. I knew you looked at that dog weird. She's just making these up. The last thing you searched was porn. No, 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 no. Don't say that. Hub. Ew, Ew whoa. what a freak. Is that why you were in the bathroom Ew, during so the long? school day? Could you tell me my search history? You looked up how to get away with murder. And I was thinking about you while I did it. I have had enough with you. Please be normal. The reason your parents split up is because your dad slept with the pool boy. Honestly, I don't blame him. The pool boy was hot. Did you do the math homework? You stole a pair of socks from your ex-girlfriend and you smell them every night before bed. That's where my favorite pair of socks went? Ew! If you're so smart, why do you have no emotion? You're sexually attracted to SpongeBob. I just like his square shape, okay? Do you ever have any regular thoughts? You're an iPad kid that still watches Coco Melon. I just think it's entertaining. I just wanted to let you know you're like really annoying everyone. The reason and your hamster died is because you tried to get him to do a backflip but actually chucked him out the window you're the one who killed hamantha i cannot believe you killed my hamster you sell feet pics i need my starbucks money feet pics are a good business you buy her feet pics she has pretty toes hey girl how are you you set the house on fire because you didn't like your dad's new girlfriend and she died in it i also set the school on fire so run Okay, but if all of us stop paying taxes, they can't arrest everyone, right? No, that's not how that works. Soulmate controls my hands. What does that even mean? Ow! Oh no, I don't like this. Sis, could you hold this for one sec? Sure. Wait, what are you doing? Oh no. Why would you throw that? It had grandma's ashes in it. I am so sorry. Yeah, tell that to grandma. I was on the floor now. Oh, uh, excuse me. Class, who would like to present first? Bailey, great. Go ahead. Great. My project is about uh what are you doing are you feeling okay <laughs> i wish i knew seriously what did you just dab <laughs> ew oh my god that was the worst thing i've ever done if you don't present you'll get a zero in the project what's happening uh oh oh you just punched me in the face it wasn't me you're still holding your hands up like you're gonna fight me you can't take a dog out of somebody's yard he probably has an owner <laughs> He's so fluffy, I couldn't resist. Oh no, not this again. Could I borrow that pink top you have? Meow. The fuck? Meow. You have the humor of a preschooler. You know, hablas inglés. You were just speaking English to me. Puro ir a baño. I have never heard you speak Spanish before. Bailey, do you want to hang later? Howdy, y'all. Would y'all like to sip my moonshine? Uh, what? Let's go down to the creek and do some fishing. You know what? Never mind. Please don't hang out with us. Seriously, what's wrong with you? Ow, 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 ow. Are you, like, possessed or something? No! Okay, somebody get this bitch a muzzle. $20 to me or my mom. I don't really need it right now, so maybe she can use it. Hey, that bracelet is so cute. When did you get it? Oh, I used the $20 that I got this morning to go and buy it. What did you get? I gave my 20 to my mom, so nothing. That's cute or whatever, but I needed this bracelet. Do you see how cute it is? A new car? What? Well, if I give it to my mom, she'll probably just give me her old one, so... Dude, there is no way you gave that one to your mom, too. I'm gonna get a G-Wagon for my car. <sighs> Wait, why aren't you taking any of them for yourself? I don't know. I'm happy with what I have, so it's fine. 
Okay, you are insane if you give this one to your mom too. Well, I'm probably still gonna live with her anyway, so it's our house. You have fun with that? I'm gonna go live in a mansion, okay? I just know you're gonna <laughs> regret that. Ooh, I could get a mansion on the beach. Um, did you just get another one too? Um, no, I only got the three questions before. I think I just got $10 million. Um, what? What do you mean? It just says plus $10 million. Dude, what? You are so lucky. You have to give me some of that. You can have some. I can't keep it all, but I have to tell my mom. Why do you give everything to your mom? You should keep it for yourself instead. Maybe I want to, okay? I love her. I want some of the money too. Yeah, you better give me some for lunch. Me too. Um, I have to go. Honey, I'm sorry, but there's leftovers in the fridge for dinner. I didn't have enough money for a new meal tonight. You don't need to worry about it anymore. Why? What are you talking about? Check the bank account. How many zeros is that? $10 million? Where did you get all of this from? Thank you so much. This is going to change our lives. I love you. You guys need to give me all of the money right now. Whoa, hang on a second. You need to transfer all $10 million into my account by the end of the day or else. Save my mom or save all the money. You have to keep all the money, sweetheart. It'll change your life. No, mom, I can't do that to you. At least I would die knowing that you'll stay happy. I'm sorry, we can find money another way. No way, you actually just gave me all of the money. See you later, suckers. I can't believe you just did that for me. I love you. Of course, I love you. We need to find some other way to make money. I'll get a second job. It'll be fine. I'll be happy with anything as long as it's with you. Me too. Bailey, I heard a rumor that you actually lost all the money. Yeah, it's true. I bet you're so jealous now that you have nothing. I have such a nice car and a house. Whatever. You are just so dumb. I would have saved all the money over my mom. You know what? Even if I did have the money, I wouldn't have given any of it to you. Why? What? You said that you would. You're just kind of a bitch. Um, excuse me? You have to keep blinking! Girl, I'm trying. I'm kind of forgetting how to blink. What? How many did you get? Two. You cannot let them run out. Okay. Hey, Bailey, look at me. No. Why? You're just staring at the wall. I know you're going to make me try to blink, and I literally have two, so don't do it. Class, today for home ec, we're going to be cutting up some onions. Are you kidding me? Can I opt out of this activity? No, it's a mandatory grade. I feel sick. Ugh. Ugh, fine. Okay, thank you. Honey, what's wrong? You look like a deer in headlights. You need to take some eye drops. I can't take eye drops. Those will make me blink. Your eyes are irritated. You need to. <laughs> hey, wait. I'll give you some blinks. I have a lot. Oh, my gosh. Thank you. Okay, I think they're transferring right now. Oh. Oh. oh my gosh, you're a lifesaver. Does this mean I can get your number now? That was fast and forward. Why are you still making that face? What face? Shocked? You have blinks. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> you almost ran out of blinks. Be careful. Oh, it's fine. No one even knows what happens when you run out. Um, I do. You die. What? I cannot believe that you didn't know. How do you know that? I thought it was obvious that everyone knew. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't run out of blinks. You're freaking me out. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Guys, what's going on in here? Billy's about to use all of his blinks at once. Stop! Don't do it! Boo! Annoying bitch. If you run out of blinks, you die. Ah! What? I only have five blinks left! Wait, guys, don't panic. Everyone calm down, crying will use up your blinks. Uh-oh. Oh, we're all gonna die! Guys, please, there must be another way we can just not blink. What if everyone just kept their eyes closed? How is everyone gonna see if our eyes are shut? It's better than totally running out of blinks. There is no way this is gonna work. Okay, open your eyes. How many blinks did you lose? It only went down one. That means it works. Everybody, close your eyes. Everyone's just gonna start running into the walls. Well, it's better than everybody dying, huh? I guess so. I think that it's this way. Oh, that looked like it hurt. Everyone, we need your attention now. I wonder what this is about. You don't die when you run out of blinks. You just can't see. So you're a liar? What? No, I didn't know. But you told me that... Haha, uh -huh, sorry I lied. April Fools? It's not even April! Get her! Guys, please, it was a mistake. 
How much energy did you get today, honey? 2%. No, that's not good at all. Bailey, you cannot be sleeping on that right now. But he's my friend. You're supposed to lead us in the debate. You're gonna make us all fail. Here, drink this. What is it? It's a secret magic potion. Good, I think it'll make you feel better. How do you feel? Oh, okay. Are you good? Have you guys ever done a backflip? Because I've never done one what I feel like I'm doing right now. Yeah, I don't think you should try that. Do you remember the debate materials? Oh yeah, I remember everything since the beginning of time. Okay, let's hope that you do well then. Would both parties please introduce themselves? Hi, I like sleeping, eating, going to the bathroom, having snacks, going to the gym, going for a hike, painting. Okay, that's quite enough. And stop moving. I can't stop moving. It's in my blood. I got the dancing juices going through me. This is not dance class. What was in that drink you gave me? Can I have four more of them? I've never felt better in my entire life. I feel like I conquered the entire world right now and become president i think i made a mistake bailey hello she's on zero you shouldn't have given her that drink dude i think you broke her uh nurse i can bring her energy back up but we don't know where it will land do it we need her to win okay she's back whoa that's way too much energy where is she going wait where did you just go i just ran an entire lap around the school do you want to see me do it again i can do it in one second nurse you have to try again this can't be right all right let me try restarting the system again maybe it'll fix her no, no, no. Now she doesn't have any energy at all. We need her. I don't feel so well. Suck it up, cupcake. You need to try it again. She's literally snoring. I can restart one more time, but any more than that and she'll die. 89%. That's perfect. She can compete. How's she Boobledorf? Um, what did you just say? She's calling Bia Bia. Oh, I forgot to mention there might be some side effects to the restart. Oh, California is not a country. Then why is it built like one? A million dollars now or a hundred dollars every time I blink? I'm not really good at math, but I do know how to blink. Um, dude, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Stop that. Your eyes are freaking me out. Seriously, please. Fine, I'll stop for a while. Why were you blinking like that? I don't know. I think I got something in my eye. It was really bad. No, no, please don't start doing it again. Oh my god, I'm so scared of you. <sighs> Guys, I think she's possessed. Back, I say, back! Okay, okay, damn. Finally, please do not blink like that. I blink so many times, I think that I forgot how to blink. Don't be dramatic, <sighs> you know how to blink. Oh, I'm rich. Okay, but if all of us stop paying taxes, they can't arrest everyone, right? No, that's not how that works. Soulmate controls my hands, what does that even mean? Ow! Oh no, I don't like this. Sis, could you hold this for one sec? Sure. Wait, what are you doing? Oh no. Why would you throw that? It had grandma's ashes in it. I am so sorry. Yeah, tell that to grandma who's on the floor now. Uh, excuse me. Class, who would like to present first? Bailey, great, go ahead. Great. My project is about... Uh, what are you doing? Are you feeling okay? <laughs> I wish I knew. Seriously, what? Did you just dab? <laughs> Ew. Oh my god, that was the worst thing I've ever done. If you don't present, you'll get a zero in the project. What's happening? Uh-oh. Oh, you just punched me in the face. It wasn't me. You're still holding your hands up like you're gonna fight me. You can't take a dog out of somebody's yard. He probably has an owner. <coughs> He's so fluffy, I couldn't resist. Oh no, not this again. Could I borrow that pink top you have? Meow. The fuck? Meow. You have the humor of a preschooler. You know, I'm less English. You were just speaking English to me. Puro ir a baño. I have never heard you speak Spanish before. Bailey, do you want to hang later? Howdy, y'all. Would y'all like to sip my moonshine? Uh, what? Let's go down to the creek and do some fishing. You know what? Never mind. Please don't hang out with us. Seriously, what's wrong with you? Ow, 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 ow. Are you, like, possessed or something? No! <laughs> okay, somebody get this bitch a muzzle. Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Want to come with? I don't know. Rock music isn't really my thing. Ugh, no wonder your innocence is 100%. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. My outfit is fine. I like being comfortable. <laughs> you're gonna regret that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Actually, I'm here for the rock concert. Oh, okay, then go ahead. You sure you don't want the outfit? Give it to me. You look so cool. And where did you get the boobs? Shut up. Jessica, I didn't know that you were coming. Oh my god, hey guys. Lucky you, we have two extra backstage passes. Do you want them? We'll take them. Come on guys, let's meet the band. Uh, excuse me miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, thank you. Dude, that was the lead singer of the band. What does the paper say? It has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Dude, you have to call him. No way, that's out of my comfort zone. 
Ugh, no wonder your score is so high. You're no fun. Come on, let's just go watch the show. Wait, guys. I can't call him because I'm a virgin. What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a virgin. Yeah, no shit. We could have guessed that ourselves. <laughs> you never know. Maybe he doesn't want to hook up with you. He wrote call me for a good time. What else does that mean? Either you call him or I'll do it for you. Fine, I'll call him after the show. Thank you guys so much for the support. Have a great night. Don't look at me like that. I'm gonna call him. Hello? Who is this? Uh, hi, this is the girl from backstage. Oh, good. I was hoping that you would call. Come meet me in my dressing room backstage. Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, hey, come on in. I wanted to talk to you. Hi, what's up? So, have you ever thought about becoming a singer before? I, I mean, I was in chorus, but not really. Our lead singer had a family emergency, and she's going to be gone for three weeks. Hang on a minute. Are you asking me to be in the band? Kinda. I want you to come to our tryouts later this week. Your style's cool. I think you'd make a great addition. Okay, maybe I will. Bro! Oh, were you guys eavesdropping? Yeah, we had to. You are definitely trying out. Guys, I don't even know if I can sing or not. Do you want to get your innocence score lower or not? Guys, I can't sing this song. This has a bad word in it. You're not a toddler. You can swear. You're freaking out about nothing. That was so good. Okay, I guess the worst they can say is no. Okay, this is actually happening. I'm really scared. You practice for this. You're going to be just fine. Next in line for auditions, please. Wish me luck. Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Want to come with? I don't know. Rock music isn't really my thing. Ugh, no wonder your innocence is 100%. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. My outfit is fine. I like being comfortable. <laughs> you're gonna regret that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Actually, I'm here for the rock concert. Oh, okay, then go ahead. You sure you don't want the outfit? Give it to me. You look so cool. And where did you get the boobs? Shut up. Jessica, I didn't know that you were coming. Oh my god, hey guys. Lucky you, we have two extra backstage passes. Do you want them? We'll take them. Come on guys, let's meet the band. Uh, excuse me miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, thank you. Dude, that was the lead singer of the band. What does the paper say? It has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Dude, you have to call him. No way, that's out of my comfort zone. Ugh, no wonder your score is so high. You're no fun. Come on, let's just go watch the show. Wait, guys. I can't call him because I'm a virgin. What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a virgin. Yeah, no shit. We could have guessed that ourselves. <laughs> you never know. Maybe he doesn't want to hook up with you. He wrote call me for a good time. What else does that mean? Either you call him or I'll do it for you. Fine, I'll call him after the show. Thank you guys so much for the support. Have a great night. Don't look at me like that. I'm gonna call him. Hello? Who is this? Uh, hi, this is the girl from backstage. Oh, good. I was hoping that you would call. Come meet me in my dressing room backstage. Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, hey, come on in. I wanted to talk to you. Hi, what's up? So, have you ever thought about becoming a singer before? I, I mean, I was in chorus, but not really. Our lead singer had a family emergency, and she's going to be gone for three weeks. Hang on a minute. Are you asking me to be in the band? Kinda. I want you to come to our tryouts later this week. Your style's cool. I think you'd make a great addition. Okay, maybe I will. Bro! Oh, were you guys eavesdropping? Yeah, we had to. You are definitely trying out. Guys, I don't even know if I can sing or not. Do you want to get your innocence score lower or not? Guys, I can't sing this song. This has a bad word in it. You're not a toddler. You can swear. You're freaking out about nothing. That was so good. Okay, I guess the worst they can say is no. Okay, this is actually happening. I'm really scared. You practice for this. You're going to be just fine. Next in line for auditions, please. Wish me luck. I can take your order when you're ready. Can I just get a number six? Of course. Is that all? Yeah. Uh, we give out a free dum-dum with each order. Thanks. Hey, what can I- Wait, weren't you here yesterday too? You remember me? I don't think I could forget. Let me guess, you want to get a number six. How did you know? I have no idea. It must have been <laughs> luck. And here's your dum-dum. Have a good day. Thank you.
Oh, look, it's my favorite customer. Stop, you're making me blush. So, what's your name? If you don't mind that I'm asking. It's Bailey. I don't mind. My name's Lucas. You should try the number one instead. It's my favorite. You know what? Sure. Enjoy the dum-dum and have a good day. You too. I can help who's next. Oh, hi. Where's Lucas? He moved to a different location. He doesn't work here anymore. Um, do you think you could tell me the new location that he works at? No, I can't disclose that information. Sorry. Could you move if you don't mind? There's people in line behind you. Wait, but what about the free dum-dum with each order? I'm sorry, we don't do that here. I'm never going to be able to find him again. There's like 300 locations just in my area. Are you excited to start your new job today? Yes, I can't wait to meet everyone. You'll be amazing, don't worry. Thanks. Hi everyone, welcome to your first day on the job. I'll give you guys a few minutes to get to know your coworkers. Um, excuse me, have we met before? I'm not sure, I don't think so. I'm sorry, it's just that you look really familiar for some reason. Maybe we met before or something. Well, anyway, my name is Bailey. I go by my middle name, Will. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, everybody, it's time to get started with the work day. See you later. Yeah, of course. Whoa, did you design that by yourself? Uh, yeah, I did. It's beautiful. You have a lot of talent. Thank you. I appreciate that. Now that I think of it, I definitely remember you from somewhere. I'm sure we'll figure it out at some point. Hopefully. This is going to bother me for the rest of the day. We were lucky enough today to get a catered lunch for every single one of you. <gasps> they have dum-dums! <laughs> Uh, Bailey, is something wrong? Lucas? Oh, wait, Annie sounds kind of cute. I could go with that. So what name did you get? Oh, it says Annie Erection. Bailey, are you serious? I think you need to read that one more time. What? What do you mean? Do you hear what you're saying? Annie Erection. <gasps> oh, decline. Oh, my God. I can't believe I almost accepted that. You need to figure out how to read, apparently. Whatever. Remember, you can only decline two times. I know, but the next one has to be better than that. Yeah, you better hope so. Ben. I mean, that's usually a boy's name, but I could go by Ben. What is it this time? Ben Dover. Girl, you have got to be kidding me, right? Not again. Oh, hey, Amanda. Yeah, that's not my name anymore. It's Taylor Swift now. That's the name you got? Yeah, isn't it awesome? What did you get? You don't want to know. Please be good. PP time. I don't want to be called PP. Sis, please tell me there's another way to change my name. There is, but you're not going to like it. Tell me how to change my name. I can't be called PP time forever. The only way that you can change your name now is to go and steal one from someone else. What? I'm not doing that. I knew you would say that. What happens if I just hit the decline button again? No, no, you cannot do that. Why not? Because your name will be completely randomized. It might be better. Or it could be like way worse. Fine, how do I steal a name? All you need to do is slap someone in the face and their name transfers over to you. Hey, Taylor. Oh, hey, girl, what's going on? Dude, why did you just slap me? You said that would work. Okay, I was just kidding. I didn't know you were really going to do it. <clears throat> Sorry, I think your only choice is just to hit decline. Okay. Please. Mike Hunt. Whoa, I'm sorry. What did you just say? Mike Hunt. That's what it says. Do you hear yourself? Mike Hunt. I can't even say that with a straight face. You should have took pee pee time. I know that now. There has to be someone I can talk to to fix this. Try going to their headquarters here. Hi, I'm- Take a ticket and wait in the line. Your number will be called. Okay. Number 69, Mike Hunt. Please don't call me that. So, what seems to be the problem? All of the names that I got were prank names. That's odd. Was it every name you got? That is definitely not right. We'll fix it for you. Really? Amazing. According to our database, someone hacked into your name system. Why would someone do that? To block you from getting your true identity. Have you met your family before? I live with them? No, I mean like your birth family. I'm sorry to tell you this, but I think you were kidnapped as a kid. What? What are you talking about? Well, you look exactly like Queen Meredith did when she was young. Okay, and a lot of people look alike. It's uncanny, but the whole family died in a car accident. Princess Sophia is still alive. Yes, but I believe that you are her. 
No, the system already gave that name away to the girl who it belonged to. That's what I'm trying to tell you. It didn't belong to her. It belongs to you, and that's why they blocked it. What? But why would someone want to steal my identity? To uncover the fortune of the royal family. How much money are we talking about? Seven billion dollars. We have to stop them, right? Today we want you to go home and do not say anything. Why would I do that? Because we're gonna come take care of it. Hey, sweetheart, I'm so sorry about the terrible name you got. It's fine, I can just make a nickname. FBI, open up! Quick, grab Sophia, we need to get out of here right now. How did you only get one brain cell today? <laughs> it's like there's no thoughts in your head. Do you just think of sparkles and rainbows? Yes. Bailey, you got a zero on your test. You just wrote slave for every answer. Mm -hmm. On this one, you didn't even write anything. You just drew a smiley face. You look so pale. Here, put on some blush. Um, what are you doing? That is definitely not how you're supposed to use it. It goes on your face. You know what? Yeah, you're doing great, sweetie. Try this lip gloss instead. Okay. No, you just have to twist to open it. None of these things are edible. They're for your face. Not your teeth. You need to wipe that off. Drink this to get it off your teeth. What the fuck? You're supposed to drink it out of the top? Okay, what? Please, please stop doing that. I will be right back. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone. Okay. What? Who gave her a lighter? She lit her hair on fire. You got two brain cells? It doesn't look like the second one is doing much. Hey, Bailey, you have to listen to everything I say today, okay? Okay. Guys, this is my life-size Malibu Barbie doll. Give them away. Whoa. Wow, she's so cool. Oh my god, I want one. She even has some signature slogans. Roast beef. I don't think that's one of them. How about we try a different phrase? Are you my daddy? Sorry, she must be malfunctioning or something. Let's just try a nice normal one. Boobies. Okay, seriously, what are we, fourth graders? Oh, she can do some tricks too. Show them. Um, why is she making that face? <laughs> Ew, what the fuck? So if she's like a robot doll, she must be smart. What's the capital of the U.S.? Barbie land. Um, no, that's not the capital. Mommy milkers. Why is she looking at me like that? I will kill your entire family. Finally, you got brain cells today. The Eiffel Tower has 1,710 steps. Bitch, what? Watching TV burns 10% more calories than sleeping. Wait a second. Tell me another fun fact. Flamingos can only eat with their heads upside down. You're like a walking encyclopedia. Follow me right now. That sounds delightful. First to guess how many jelly beans are in this Ferrari gets to keep it. So how many jelly beans are inside the car? 1,425,789. That's exactly right. Enjoy your new Ferrari. Wait, can you do my homework too? Done. How did you finish that in two seconds? Huh, what else do you know? A pig's orgasm lasts for 30 minutes. Okay, maybe let's not repeat that one. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? 364. This is so cool, you know everything. Human corpses can continue to move for a year after death. Okay, someone turn her off now. You can't be stupid again today. You have to lead us in the debate. Those seven brain cells better do the work. Bro, she cannot compete, she's as smart as a toenail. Hey, Bailey, what you doing? Magic. Yeah, we're screwed. I'd like both parties to present themselves to everyone. Hi, I enjoy sleeping and eating. Dude, what? This is going to be such an easy win. I love pineapple on pizza. Give me your thoughts on saving the economy. I believe we should replace currency with selfies. Interesting take. How would that work? Sexy selfies are worth more than ugly selfies. Wow, that's brilliant. If you could elect one person to become president, who would it be? Taylor Swift. Good job, that was the only right answer. Bailey has won the debate for her team. This has got to be a prank. Where are the cameras? Hey, who's that girl over there? Oh, her? We call her Silent Beauty. She can't say anything. Why don't we go say hi? No, you cannot be seen with her. Whatever, guys. Hey, uh, my name's Ethan. I really like your hair. You remind me of the purple Teletubby. So, let me guess, you don't have any words. Uh, don't worry, I can speak for you then. Oh, hell no, you did not bring her over here. She is not sitting with us. Why not? She's cool. No, she's not. She's just a weirdo. Wait, whoa, 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 don't leave. I'll come sit with just you instead, not them. I just wish you could speak up for yourself. She's awful. You're the only person who's ever been nice to me. Whoa, what? You can speak? I thought you had zero words. No, I have infinite. What? You have infinite words?
But everyone thinks you can't speak. I convinced everybody that I didn't have any words, but I do. But why won't you talk to anyone if you have words? Do you see how mean they are? I've been recording them. Recording them? What are you gonna do with it? Don't worry about it. How long have you been doing this? It started freshman year. I decided I was not gonna speak at all. And no one ever figured you out? Nope, they're kinda dumb. You can't tell anyone that I can actually speak, okay? I promise I am not going to. Do you want to help me expose them? Expose them like how? I know all their secrets because they think I can't tell anybody. Would we be like Bonnie and Clyde then? Yeah, I guess you could say that. This sounds like fun. Deal. Deal. Wait, what even is your name? It's Bailey. That's pretty. How are we going to do this? Don't worry. I already have it figured out.